There is no charge for awesomeness. Hi everybody, Guru Bob, and welcome to day six of the 30 day challenge. By now you should have seen a video from Dan showing you how to organize your own domains and hosting, if that's the path you've chosen, or you'll, uh, you'll be aware that there is a free service that you can utilize um, through WordPress Direct. Ed will have shown you how to open up a WordPress Direct account and how to install your first blog, which, mean, which means that you've picked a theme, you've added your category keywords, and, uh, and you set up your first blog, either in a subdomain on one of the WordPress Direct uh, free hosting domains or on a domain that you may have purchased for yourself. What I'm going to show you in this video is how to get your first article onto your blog and also how to um, put your affiliate product information into a sale offer widget on the sidebar of your blog. Now, WordPress Direct is a third-party service, as, as uh, Ed probably explained. They also have a fantastic support interface at wordpressdirect.com forward slash support. So if you have any issues or problems with, um, with the service, then please uh, put a ticket in and I'm sure you'll get um, uh, some, some great customer service uh, as soon as they can get through to it. Now, what WordPress Direct is obviously install a WordPress blog, and there's no cutbacks here. In fact, the, the, the WordPress blog that's being installed is as optimized as it can possibly be, at least from Dan and my perspective, for search engine optimization. All of the uh, SEO plugins that you will need are being installed, and all of the required SEO settings have been uh, automatically set up when you installed your blog to get the maximum possible chance of having good keyword optimization through your blog, so you can be confident of that. Um, and the principle of WordPress Direct is that, you, that most of the time you'll manage your blog through the WordPress Direct interface. So that makes it very easy because uh, it means that you'll hardly ever have to, or maybe even never have to, log into the WP Admin um, uh, interface that's the normal way that you interface with your blog. Okay, without further ado, let's have a look at, uh, at the blog. So this is the blog that Ed installed this morning on our domain, vintageelectricguitarblog.com. And you can see we've got a great theme here, um, highly relevant, um, and it is, for all intents and purposes, a completely empty blog, but it's already you know, reasonably optimized from uh, a non-page perspective for our target key phrase, which is vintage electric guitar. Now you'll notice that the, the blog is suggesting there are no categories. Well, that's, that's only in terms of the way it's being displayed. Um, Ed did enter the categories when he installed the blog, and they are there, they have been registered. But until you start posting uh, information and content on your blog underneath these categories, then those categories will not appear. You'll also notice here that there's a, such a thing called a sale offer on the left-hand side. That is where our, our affiliate offer is going to go once we've actually set that up. So without further ado, let's start putting some content on. Head on over to the wordpressdirect.com interface, log in using the same account that Ed used this morning, and sure enough, here is our blog. It tells us the URL and the title and so forth. It also gives us a bit of an indication of what the page rank is, so as your blog gets a bit of uh, authority, then, uh, then that, should, that should begin to change. And we're going to be using these, um, these options here. Now, you, you might recall I gave you the support um, link uh, before. You can also get to the support in your uh, WordPress Direct Control Panel by this link down here uh, below the, uh, the main buttons. As a free WordPress Direct um, user, you'll have uh, three inst installs in your free account. If you've chosen to go with the $1 trial, then, um, then you'll have up to 15 installs. Um, plus access to some of the other m magnificent uh, content posting functionality that WordPress Direct offers that we won't be covering at this early stage of the challenge, but we will we'll be introducing you to that later on in the challenge. So we're, we're going to go on the Write New Post link here and go and start adding an article. Now, um, you can add all of the really, the most of the information that you want to add in relation to a post you can do inside WordPress Direct which is really great. We can add a title, we can add the content, we can add tags, and of course we can select the category that we want to publish this post under. Now I'm going to use an article that we've, uh, that we've had written for Vintage Electric Guitar, and um, you can see that the article, I have this article in a text file, 
Uh, so there's no formatting here, which is exactly the way I want it. And I'm just going to copy and paste the information from this article and put it into the title. And I'm going to copy the content of the article, copy it out of there, and I'm going to paste it inside the post content area of the uh, of the write post module. Now at this early stage, this is the first article on the blog. So I want this first article to be highly optimized for my main keyword, which in this case is vintage electric guitar. That's why I've put it into the title. And I'm also it also is several times in the post content, but I'm going to do just a little bit extra as well. I'm going to actually highlight certain instances of the keyword and I'm going to add some emphasis. In, this, in, the, in the first paragraph I'm going to bold that keyword. And I'm going to find another instance of the, of, the, of the keyword. I can see another one here in the middle of the article and I'm going to underline that. And if I had more instances here, um, some of them I would leave normal and some of them I would uh, apply some emphasis. You don't, you don't need to do more than one of this. But what we're effectively telling the spiders is that, hey, there's some, there's some emphasis being applied to a certain key phrase. And that's because that's what this, key, this post is most relevant to. Now, tomorrow, we'll be converting one of these, uh, the, the bottom phrase here, we'll be converting that to a tracked link, which will, which will link through to your affiliate product. But that's, that's for tomorrow. At this stage, we'll just leave this, this as it is. Now I need to add a tag, of course. I'm just going to put my main key phrase here, Vintage Electric Guitar, and I'm going to publish it under the category Vintage Electric Guitar. Because when you set up your blog, the theme keyword that you use to actually title your blog also becomes one of your categories. And then if you've got any other keywords within your micro niche that meet your traffic and competition criteria, you can add those in as extra categories. And in the future, you'll be able to actually post underneath those categories. So that's, that's it. all it takes. Click Submit Post, and we are done. We can head on over to the blog now, and we can refresh the browser. And sure enough, there's our blog, and there's our article. You can see that the keyword that I highlighted and bolded is bolded, and the one that I underlined is also underlined. Now, as I said to you earlier on, we actually have made sure that these, these blog installations are as optimized as they can be. And there's a number of, um, of very useful plugins that we have ensured are auto-installed when these blogs get installed through WordPress Direct. And I want to highlight two of them here. You might recall that I actually put a tag underneath the post when I actually uh, uh, submitted the article. Now, that's a WordPress tag. and uh, that's fine. I mean that that uh, that works well for the WordPress inside the WordPress um, website and functionality. But we also want to uh, let Technora Technorati know because Technorati is a major blog uh, uh, search search engine uh, that uh, we have an article on this blog that is highly uh, optimized for a particular key phrase. So there's a special plugin on this blog called. Um, uh, WP tags to Technorati, which which basically puts the Technorati tags, converts the WP ta WordPress tags to Technorati tags, and puts them below the post here. Which 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 means that um, if somebody were to search for vintage electric guitar in Technorati, then hopefully this blog will come up as a uh, as as a uh, um, as having content in relation to that particular tag. What you can also see below the post here is a social bookmarking plugin. This is known, this is the Add This plugin, which means that if somebody is likes this content, they want to bookmark it, they can select one of these various so social bookmarking services, and they can bookmark that um, that uh, that post in their own bookmarking account, which gives you the possibility of getting a backlink um, back to your blog. So that's how you basically post an article. So half the job is done. Now what we're going to do is we're going into the ads and banner setup area because we want to put our affiliate promotion onto the blog as well in the side in the sidebar. The WordPress Direct guys have done a fantastic job of building um, uh, promotional functionality into their uh, their interface here, and we have a sale offer which is um, which I showed you before goes into this area of the blog here, and there's also a place where you can upload a banner which will appear between the header of the blog here and the first post. And you can also put a banner at the bottom of the blog between the footer and the last post. 
Now today we're only going to be talking about adding the sale offer because that's we've already pulled that information together. But later in the challenge we'll we'll show you how to actually add a banner to your blog as well if you if you wish to have one. Now Dan, you might, might recall from day four, Dan pulled some affiliate product information together for us, um, and I'm going to be using that here today. Um, I can not only put some copy into this uh, into this offer and give it a title, but I can also add an image here today, and I'm going to show you how to do that. And that's of course why Dan showed you how to grab a, a product image, um, because this is exactly where you're going to use it. So the first thing we're going to do is title this. We're going to call this the Vintage Guitar Price Guide, because that's what it is. Um, now, if we want to upload an image, and we don't need to, but if we do, we must put the image tag into the uh, into the blog here. And um, I'm going to I'm going to center that image because uh, I want it centered within the, um, the 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 sale offer on my on my widget. Having put that image tag there, I need to upload the image uh, into WordPress Direct, and I'm going to do that by clicking uh, and selecting my image, which is on my desktop here. You can see this is the price guide. I'm going to click on Open, so that uh, WordPress Direct now knows where to go and get that image. Having done that, I'm going to take my promotional copy and I'm going to copy and paste that into the body of this uh, of this sale offer section. Now this is also a rich text editor, so I can um, highlight certain parts of this um, and uh, emphasize certain things. So I can emphasize that if I wish to. What I'm also going to do here, after I've um, brought the image in, is I'm going to add some links into this offer. Now, I am actually going to show you how to do that here. Tomorrow we're going to be replacing those links with actual track links, but I do want to be able to show you today how to add an a link into your aff affiliate offer just in case after you've um, published your blog, you might, you never know, you might actually get a click come to your blog for, for, for whatever reason. Sometimes the search engine spiders can come very quickly. So I want to make sure that at least the affiliate offer does point off to the thing that we're wishing to promote. So if I click sale, Save Sale Offer here, then WordPress Direct will go and get my image and put it into my, put it into my sale area. And, uh, and it's now saved that on the blog. Um, before I go and check that out, I'm going to add some links in here though. So I'm going to select my image, click on the little anchor, the anchor here, which is a way for me to insert and edit a link. A little box will come up. And I'm going to get my affiliate URL that that, uh, that Dan saved for us on day four. Put that into the link URL here. I'm going to set the, um, the any clicks on that uh, URL to open up a new window. And I get another opportunity here. Look at this to add my my keyword that I want to target. So it's yet another piece of on-page optimization by by giving me a title uh, link in my in in my link. Um, which is a title tag inside a, an HTML link. And I'm going to click Insert. So now that image is a clickable link, and if someone clicks on it, it will go off to the affiliate product. Similarly, I'm going to take the last part of my copy here, click here to get your copy today. I'm going to turn that into, an, into a, a link as well. So again, I get my little link come, comes up. I can copy my, um, my affiliate URL into here, set it to open in a new window again, put my tag in again, and I am good to go. That's now a link. So my image is a link, and this last bit of text is also a link. Click Save Sale Offer, and I'm done. I can now go over to my blog, click Update, and there you go. How good is that? We now have a article highly optimized for our target key phrase. Because we've published on that article, we now have our category uh, in the sidebar of the blog, 
and we have used the sale offer widget to put our um, affiliate promotion um, into, uh, into the blog, into the uh, sidebar of the blog. So if somebody comes here and they're interested in the Vintage Guitar Price Guide, then whoop, they'll click on here and they will be sent off to Amazon where they can buy. And if they buy, we make some money. Gotta love that. This is what it's all about. All right, well, this is what I hope that you'll be able to do by the end of day six. You'll have installed your blog, which is optimized for your main keyword. You'll have published an article, again, optimized for your main keyword. And you'll have um, populated the sale offer widget um, in, in your blog, promoting the product that you chose when you went hunting on day four. Hopefully all that was self-evident. I think you will find that WordPress Direct is the most amazing and easiest way of publishing an, a highly optimized search engine optimized blog on either your domain or on one of their free subdomains. It's a fantastic service. It's extremely easy to use. And uh, I hope you get your blogs up um, as easy as I showed you in this video. There is no charge for awesomeness.